Silvio beat zero to none, so the loser of Three, might be this match. All right, yeah, loser of this fight, Silvio, and losers. So Young Link versus Palutena. These are both characters who are pretty skittery, you know, uh, pretty fast characters. So. You, ever, you ever see a like a spider come at you real fast? Yeah, <laughs> that's, yeah. That's these characters. That's, def <laughs> that's definitely these characters. Uh, so you have Baby Rage versus Mommy Girlfriend. Uh, shout out to Stay Frozen. <laughs> um, yeah, I'm, I'm not too sure what to think about this matchup because of, like, the projectile game that Young Link is going to try and, like, implement. Because, like, as you can see, the Fro Frozen is just kind of, like, dancing around it. But because he's also a fast character, he's not, like, taking too much from it. Although he hasn't gotten too many hits in, and Frozen has been doing enough, like, pot shots to, like, rack him all the way up to a 110. Yeah, one of the big things about this match in particular, Young Link can struggle to kill, as we mentioned before. And against Palu, that's going to be really big. If he's able to get early stocks, if he's able to just at least consistently finish off stocks, it's going to be a huge check mark in his favor because Palu doesn't really struggle with that herself. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you can see already he's looking for a back throw, even a back air. There are lots of ways that, there are lots of reasons for extra O to be scared right now. There's that back air finding his mark through all of those projectiles. But 96% onto Frozen is not that bad for extra O. Especially if he's able to confirm into those kills, which, oh, 125% on Palu is so scary. Just because it feels like her combos are just so good at every percent. Clever up here. Tony used that tone of voice. Literally, literally baby rage in the Twitch chat. Like I, I can't stand Young Link's voice. <laughs> <laughs> He's basically Mario from like Yoshi's Island. You know what I'm talking about? Sorta. Baby Mario, how he'll like yeah, scream yeah. when you like leave him alone for yeah, two seconds. Yeah, but that doesn't like grate your ears. Oh, uh, like. excuse me. <laughs> I, I I I think Young Link's on another level. That's all. I think it's just because Young Link does it while also killing you. Maybe. Anyway, so. <laughs> <sighs> yeah. <laughs> That's it. Wow. All right. So one thing that uh really ended up being a factor in that game was the edge guards. Mm -hmm. uh, you have to always be aware of Explosive Flame's existence. Uh, it's just such a, f so potent. And its utility is just, it just serves a purpose that I don't think any other move in the game does. Where it's like, I'm just gonna put this here. And if you die from it, then it's your own fault. Okay. <laughs> Where are we going? So, Frozen got rid of Kalos in town. Actually, that makes a lot of sense because of, like, those, like, arrows, the arrows to up B combos. Like, those pla that, those platforms will definitely, like, extend the combo all the way in into the blast zone. I so, think there might also be... So, Young yeah. Link has a uh, wall jump, correct? Yeah. Okay, so I have a feeling that that might be one of the reasons why I'm picking this stage here. Having a wall, because he, like, he lost two stocks from going high against Palu. So I think maybe he's just looking for alternate recovery options. Yeah, I mean, you can definitely, he can definitely, like, extend his recovery uh, with a little bit of a mix with the wall jumps. Uh, I also think that it just goes into favor where, like, with Town and Kalos out, uh, this is probably the next best stage for uh, for the similarities of what you gain from those stages as well. So that, in addition to the wall jumps, uh, makes this a pretty good candidate. And, you know, te versus the teleport recovery uh, could work out as just a, a character counter pick as well. Oh, oh. God. Oh, and the bomb actually helps him out, gives him a little bit more air. And that air is exactly what he needed. It meant that he could drift just a little bit past. He is alive and kicking. 85% on Frozen is actually pretty dangerous. Mm -hmm. He can absolutely extra, oh, could confirm into a lethal move right here. 
but just finds the dash attack. Noticing that slight overextension. I think he approached with an arrow right there. And so, next, let me just double check. There was a, yeah, he approached with an arrow on that last stock. So I think that moving forward, he has to be really careful and recognize that that move. Oh, good. No, nope, no, nope. there, there's the wall jump, yeah. And then he air dodged, but it didn't matter. He made it back anyway. Ooh. Oh, that cow. Oh, my. This combo was still going. All right. And finally. Just like that, yeah. the percents are all evened up. Yeah, that's one thing that to, uh, Young Link definitely has. And I will say, Young Link's combos are super. They feel dynamic. They feel kind of cool and flashy. The quickest kid to pull a bow around these parts. Link the kid. Okay, you're trying to make me hate the voice, aren't you? It's, I, I don't have to try. It's very easy to hate the voice. <laughs> you're, you're trying to make, you're trying to speed the process along. That's an up smash out of shield. Wow. All right. All right. So. I don't think the parry was necessary there, technically. But uh, Extra O has managed to get this down to a last stock situation, which is much better than that game one. He kind of was blown out, and this time around, Maybe it's the stage, maybe it's just he's figuring out a better way to approach the matchup. But as I'm saying that, he actually hasn't gotten a hit in quite a bit. Oh, but there's that one hit. Let's see if he can get a lot off of it. Rosen has been doing a really good job using his dash attack to stuff out the landing approaches from Ooh. Extra O. Is that something that Extra O needs to be a little bit careful on? And I mean, it's the sort of thing where you can probably bait that out as a young Link. Like, I wonder if you like run towards it and be reverse arrow so that you wouldn't get hit by the dash attack. That'd be some real cool stuff. <gasps> Boomerang coming back. The last hit of that up air almost doing him in, but Extra O is alive at 105%, though. He's not looking super healthy. There are lots of things that Frozen could do right now to end him. He's off stage, which means neutral air is a super big threat, uh. and there it is. That's going to be the set. Extra O doing a really good job fighting for his life in that game, too, but just not quite enough. The consistency from Frozen is what brings him over the finish line.